Does your Realtek high definition audio cause you some serious driver issues either with a microphone or with the speakers like stuttering might appear or uh, maybe the sound settings app crash all the time? Well, then I'll have the fix for you. Well, hello and welcome to Dimodism Total Notary Channel. What you need to do is basically use another type of driver. So how do we do this? Well, we do it like this. You click the Windows and the X key. Here we get this menu and you can launch the, the, the device manager as it is called. On the device manager, we go down here. We have sound, video and game controllers. Here we have the Realtek High Definition Audio. What you want to do is you want to right click this and you go to update the driver. Before you complete this step, you should note that the sound from your system will disappear and you need to restart the computer for the sound to come back. So watch the entire video before you follow all of my instructions. Then you do like this, browse my computer for driver software. And then you select let me pick from a list of available drivers. Then you make sure this show compatible hardware is checked. And then you should see Realtek High Definition Audio and High Definition Audio Device. Select the High Definition Audio Device, not the Realtek one, and click Next. Click Yes to this box. You can always revert the changes afterwards if you are unhappy with it. Then you will need to restart your computer for the changes to take effect. When a computer is restarted again, you can go into Device Manager again and you can see that you now have the high definition audio device. However, we are not completely done yet. You can also go to the control panel and click sound here. And inside here you can see it's called high definition audio device, uh, as well as on the microphone. Windows Update may install new drivers, the Realtek drivers that will override this change or at least did for me, which eventually will bring back the problems you just fixed. If you need to stop this, what you can do is you go to the control panel, go to devices and printers. Inside devices and printers, find your computer, right click it and go down to device installation settings. On the device installation settings, you will click no on do you want to automatically download manufacturers apps and custom icons available for your devices. Click no and save the changes. This may cause some other stuff to not work properly. And if you notice that, just change that back and let Windows Update do its job. But then you might need to go back to Device Manager and basically install the Windows High Definition drivers instead of the Realtek ones. Because unfortunately, the Realtek drivers haven't worked very well for, well, they never work very well, sadly. I hope this little video helped you with your microphone problems. And if it did, please leave a like. Do subscribe and I'll see you in future videos. You can also donate to the channel if you really want to help it. This is Jim Total Notary Channel, signing out.